Hi, this is a quick video to show you how to remove a Marley e-bike motion uh, equipped rear wheel because it's got the motor in it. It's uh, not as straightforward as a normal wheel. First thing to do is find the power cable that goes from the battery to the motor, which looks like this, and then you need to unclip it. So unclip the wire from the frame and then pull the two plugs apart. So now the battery and the motor are no longer connected. You could use a 17mm spanner or an 8mm uh, Allen key. We use an 8mm Allen key, it's much easier, less likely to damage the frame. Uh, so give that a turn on the non-drive side to loosen it off. There we go. You don't need to remove the bolt all the way. Just bring it out a bit. And then return to the drive side, loosen it off. Now I would take this one all the way off and the washer, which has a protrusion on it. And take that off as well. And then you can drop the wheel down, change your tire, change your inner tube, to clean it, do whatever you need to do. To then put the wheel back in, make sure that the cable housing is in the right place. So just loop around so that it's gonna be able to clip back on underneath the frame afterwards. And this silver washer, make sure that the protrusion is gonna be on the underneath of the bike and will fit in line with the um, uh, eye hole uh, for the axle there. So we'll fit the washer on back on this side, on the drive side, put it over the axle with the protrusion at the bottom so it slips into the gap nice and neatly. Then put the bolt back over and tighten it and then tighten it with your eight mil Allen key. We'll do a final tighten once the bike's out of the stand and on the floor just to make sure everything's level and we'll torque the bolts up. And then onto the non-drive side, tighten it up so it's strong enough to hold the wheel in place. Then put the cable back into the clips so it runs neatly with the frame. And then finally reconnect the cable with the, the motor with the battery. Now to make sure you've done that right, there are two arrows on the cable and you need to line those two up. There's one, there's another. Make sure they're lined up and press 